Hi, this is Craig. I'm going to show you a way to draw a parabolic curve that's suitable for making cylindrical solar collectors using, say, aluminized plastic or polished uh, aluminum. And uh, this is the way to draw the parabola with just a few simple tools. A straight edge, a carpenter's rafter square, a nail, a pen, a couple of clamps, and uh, here's how it goes. I'm going to clamp the uh, straight edge in place. This edge will form the base of the uh, parabola, the deepest part of the parabola. I'm now going to find the, uh, pick the focus of my parabola. Um, in this case, I've got about 32 inches uh, width on this uh, paper. And uh, I'm going to draw a center line. And in this case, I'm going to make the focus at about six and a half inches. So I'm going to drill a pilot hole for a nail. I'm working on a piece of MDF underneath the paper. So now that's going to be the focus of my parabola. So the trick is, is you uh, pick an increment along the straight edge and you keep the corner of the square in contact with the straight edge and this edge of the square in contact with the nail. And then we'll draw a series of lines along this edge and what will be left behind is a parabola. So here we go. I'm going to start at about half an inch. I'm using a sharpie here but you'd use a finer uh, pen or a pencil or a scribe to get a really fine line and you can get right into the apex uh, near the corner here at the bottom. So but I'm going to start here I could like say at about a half inch increment and um, you can make it as fine as you like. Again, the increment doesn't really matter, but always keep the corner intact with the straight edge and this edge in contact with the nail. This one. We're going to do the same thing on the opposite side. Yeah, okay, that's about it. That's as far as I can go on that side. So you can see a, a pretty uh, smooth uh, curve. Uh, this is also called a saddle curve. It's what's left behind. Uh, from all the straight lines. Uh, now we're going to uh, do the same thing on the opposite side and I'll speed this up for you so you uh, don't have to uh, watch the whole thing. Okay, there you have it. Again, with a finer uh, point, say scribe or uh, fine pen, you can get much closer to the baseline here and get a continuous, uh, continuous parabola. So normally, this would be the part I keep. I do a, a first cut with a bandsaw or a, a jigsaw uh, along this line, leaving a little bit behind and then Sand, sand it off on a drum sander very 
carefully to just kiss the line and you end up with a very nice parabola. Thank you for watching.